he uh, has some questions of his own. But I, I just want to get something here. We'll be, as you know, uh, issuing a report on the study that we're doing here. And uh, just so I understand this correct, although we've seen this explosion in the use and in the, the uh, quantity of medical marijuana, um, we have anecdotal evidence that other pain relief, other medication uh, has diminished. That's all anecdotal. There is no evidence as far as data that says, yes, uh, the number of medications has, has been diminished, the uh, number using them has diminished, uh, other medications, and the cost has diminished. There's no uh, evidence for that. It's more anecdotal. You know, you have the veteran sitting there and says, all this medicine I don't have to take anymore. Is that correct? Mr. Chair, we actually do have evidence, as you've indicated, that the costs and the use and cost of marijuana for medical purposes has increased exponentially. We also have evidence uh, that the use of opioids and other antidepressants have gone down. Proportionally? What are, proportionally? We, what we are lacking is the causal relationship. We are lacking that one went up and the other went, went down. So but that, given the, the excessive jump, you know, in, in the use of medical marijuana, um, I mean, you know, doubling over the next year to 25 million, um, how much of, an, of a decrease? Like, I mean, is it just minuscule? Or is it, uh, you know, would it, would it, it may not be exactly proportional, but is it close? Or, or what type of evidence do you have there? Um, thank you for the question, Mr. President. It is not uh, one for one. Uh, th and that's a causal effect. We've seen a very high increase on the marijuana uh, usage and costs. Uh, but you can't, it, the relationship is not one for one. We have seen a decrease. Uh, we're trying to analyze what is that decrease and for why, but it is not directly proportional. Uh, far from it, actually. So that's what we're trying to analyze. Okay, so far from yes. proportionality. Uh, right. Yes. Now, we've only started to see that decrease. So that's why we are studying to see what will this materialize, what will it look like, uh, and, and we are tracking that and working with our partners at Medivy Blue Cross to sort of tracking the opioids, the tranquilizers, antidepressants, um, and some of the um, pain medications uh, to see what, what is the, but at, at present, today, uh, it is not directly proportional. Thank you very much. Uh, back to Ms. Mendez, please. 